Resisting Removal, The Sandy Lake Tragedy of 1850 is a historical novel based on the United States government's removal efforts of the Lake Superior Ojibwe during the early 1850s that resulted in the death of approximately 400 native Ojibwe at Sandy Lake, Minnesota. This event, despite its tragic nature, is not often acknowledged in the history of Minnesota or Wisconsin. Using a unique method of storytelling that utilizes elements of fiction and nonfiction, author Colin Mustful sheds light on a forgotten past that was filled with deceit, strife, and perseverance. Told through the perspective of Benjamin Green Armstrong, a trader and interpreter among the LaPointe Band of Ojibwe, resisting removal exposes the intentional wrongdoing of the United States Indian system while introducing readers to heroic and sometimes controversial historical figures such as Indian agent John Watrous, missionary Leonard Wheeler, and Ojibwe leader Chief Buffalo. Relying on the memoir of Benjamin Armstrong, while using fictional dialogue, scene, and setting, Resisting Removal tells the story of the LaPointe Ojibwe's successful efforts to resist illegal removal attempts and to eventually earn a new treaty in 1854 that gave them permanent reservation homes within their ancestral homeland. Throughout the narrative, Musful weaves in official correspondence from the time period exposing the intentional wrongdoing and corruption of government officials and Indian traders, including Minnesota Territorial Governor Alexander Ramsey, who is largely responsible for the Sandy Lake tragedy. The narrative also includes insightful information about the Ojibwe people, history, and culture and their perspective throughout this harrowing time period. Acknowledging that history must be viewed through multiple perspectives, author Colin Mustful invites readers to interrogate the stories they have been told, including his own. Using extensive chapter notes and a complete bibliography, Mustful reveals his sources making his novel a useful resource that allows readers to delve into those sources and further discover the truth of this important history. Resisting Removal, The Sandy Lake Tragedy of 1850, tells history through fiction and ultimately questions whose story is really being told. To learn more about the author and his work, or to schedule an author presentation, please visit his website at colinmustful.com. For more information about the publisher of Resisting Removal, please visit historythroughfiction.com.